Welcome to the voice of the Lord. Our verse for today is in Psalms 34 verse 4. I sought the Lord and he answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Fear is reality. Fear is oppressive. It can devastate. And it can destroy us, friends, if we are unable to handle it. Because a lot of people, friends, they respond to fear many ways. Some would fight back. Some would flee. They would just run away. And some would just stay where they are and cling to death. That's why even anxiety and depression could come to oppress them. But today, friends, we are told that there is a better way to handle fear. And that is to seek the Lord. That's why King David said that, I sought the Lord and he answered me. And he delivered me from all my fears. From all. So friends, why don't we do the same? Why don't we seek the Lord? Because he knows the way out to our problem. The fear, friends, that we have, there is a reason for it. And many times we are unable to handle it because, again, we are too inadequate. We are too weak to handle this. That's why we are fearful. If only we get the strength, if only we get the knowledge, abilities, friends, Maybe we can face our challenges face on. But we just don't know how to. And if that is the case, why don't we seek the Lord? Amen. That's why he was saying that I sought the Lord and he answered me. God has an answer to our problem. God has an answer to the situation that we're in so that we are so fearful. But God knows how to deal with the situation so friends seek the lord and even the lord jesus christ was saying that well if you are weary if you are heavily laden you got a problem that this had been causing you fear say why don't you come to me amen that's why that invitation friends he said that you who are weary and are heavily laden come to me that I may give you rest. That he may give us peace. That the fear that we get, friends, this will go. Because now we get the peace of God. The peace that passes all understanding. So what? why don't we do that, friends? Why don't we go to the Lord now? And say, Lord, this is my situation in life. There is this fear that had come to oppress me. But I know that you can deliver me. So, friends, today... If that is your situation, why don't you present it to God? What is causing the fear that you got? It could be health issues. Doctors say that they can do anything about it. And therefore fear comes to grip your heart. How would you respond, friends, if that is the situation? Well, seek the Lord. Amen. And trust your case to the Lord. And he will heal. Because he said that, come unto me. Come unto me, you who are weary and are heavily laden, you who are sick, so sick that nothing can be done. Say, come unto me and I give you rest. Rest to your physical body, healing to your physical body, and more especially, rest to your soul so that you will not live in fear. Then you can think properly, you can live properly, you are no longer oppressed by fear because you got your Savior with you, your Deliverer, the Lord Jesus Christ himself. And remember that when we trust him, he delivers us from all of these things. Amen. Whether this be sickness, whether this be finances, whether this be your job, your family, whatever that will be, friends, we are told that he will deliver us from all this, everything that has been causing us to be fearful. Amen. So, friends, Seek the Lord, or worship Him, serve Him. May the Lord bless you. May the Lord keep you. May His face shine upon you and be gracious unto you. May He lift up His countenance on you and give you His peace. His alone. God bless. See you again next time. Bye.